With the introduction of the Install 360 Ace Pro, Install 360, a company renowned for its innovative camera designs, has entered the world of conventional action cameras. Straying from its typical emphasis on modular setups, tiny cameras, and 360-degree cameras, with its large sensor, clever flip-out screen, and remarkable resolution, the Ace Pro is designed in the traditional GoPro fashion. It appears ready to take on the current GoPro Hero 12 Black. We were eager to investigate the showdown and compare these two competitors in depth. Let's examine the specifics and provide all the information you require. Let's start with the design. In terms of form factor, both cameras share a similar size and shape but the Instant 360 Ace Pro edges out in thickness and weight, primarily attributed to its rear flip screen. Both sport side modern mode and power buttons top record buttons, removable batteries, USB-C ports for charging, and data transfer and micro SD card slots for storage. While both cameras bow front-facing displays their functionality diverges. The GoPro front screen doubles as a preview monitor for self-filming, whereas the Insta360 Ace is a monochrome LCD showcasing current settings. The Ace Pro's flip-up touchscreen serves a similar purpose, facilitating self-filming and enhancing low-angle shooting. However, the GoPro's design proves advantages in tight mounting scenarios, where the Ace Pro flip screen might face constraints. Durability becomes a consideration with the Ace Pro's flip screen, though robust posing potential vulnerability compared to the Hero 12 flag seamless construction. Notably, the GoPro allows the easy removal and replacement of its lens protector, contrasting with the Insta360 Ace glued lens protector. Mounting mechanisms set them apart as the Ace Pro opts for a more magnetic quick-release system, akin to the DJI Osmo Action 4. This facilitates swift transitions between mounts with additional base plates. While sturdy, the GoPro fixed mounting tabs, a long-standing feature, may offer greater overall durability. The Hero 12 introduces a 1 divided by 4 by 20 tripod thread, providing added convenience, absent in the Ace Pro unless opting for Insta 360's quick-release mount accessory. Now let's talk about the image and video quality. The Hero 12 Black and the Ace Pro employ distinct approaches in their imaging sensors. The Hero 12 Black features a 1 by 1.9 inch sensor with an uncommon 8 by 7 ratio, while the Ace Pro opts for a 1 by 1.3 inches sensor in the more conventional 4 by 3 format. GoPro design excels in capturing vertical information ideal for cropping in two vertical videos and achieving an expansive field of view with the Hyperview digital lens. However, this design results in a smaller sensor during 16x9 recording, impacting low-light performance in a negative manner. In contrast, the Ace Pro utilizes most of its larger sensor during 16x9 recording delivering bright and detailed images, even in low-light conditions, showcasing a significant advantage in nighttime footage. Now, in daylight scenarios, the competition is much tighter. Both cameras produce similar-looking images with comparable color rendering. The Hero 12 Black's images may be slightly more visually appealing, rendering skin tones accurately, and maintaining a consistent wide balance yet. The difference is minimal for those less discerning. Both cameras support 4K recording at up to 120fps and 240fps in 1080p, catering to the demands of action-packed scenes. Stiller digital stabilization is a shared feature transforming even the most intense activities into smooth gimbal-like footage. The Ace Pro stands out as the first action camera offering 8K video recording, surpassing the Hero 12 Black's 5.3K capability. However, the GoPro excels at shooting 5.3K at 60fps while the Ace Pro is limited to 8K at 24fps. While 8K may not be a major draw for most users due to limited frame rates, the Hero 12 Black's Hyperview lens provides a broader FOV, especially in vertical width, enhancing the intensity of first-person biking shots. Audio recording is excellent on both cameras but the Hero 12 Black outshines in suppressing wind noise, which is a crucial aspect on an action camera. Additionally, the Hero 12 Black bows professional features such as 10-bit color, time code sync, and a genuine lock profile for color grading, features that are absent in the Ace Pro, making it a potential deal-breaker for those seeking a professional video environment. 
Now what about the apps and features? Both cameras come equipped with companion apps tailored for both iOS and Android users. The Hero 12 Black pairs with GoPro Quick while the Ace Pro syncs seamlessly with the Insta360 app. These applications share common functionalities, providing remote monitoring setting adjustments and the convenience of playback and clip editing. Both apps offer cloud syncing capabilities, automatically curating highlight videos using AI to identify compelling moments. The Ace Pro introduces distinctive features like Motion ND, replicating a slow shutter speed for artificial motion blur, and AI Warp, reloading generative AI for creating video effects. While the Ace Pro integrates with the comprehensive Insta360 Studio desktop app for Windows and Mac OS, there is no current desktop software for the Hero 12 Black. GoPro Quick for Desktop is in development with a Mac release anticipated in the future, and a Windows version expected by summer 2024. Now, despite lacking built-in GPS, the Insta360 Ace Pro can leverage GPS data from the connected phone or sync with Garmin and Apple Watches for speed and altitude overlays. The Hero 12 Black native GPS requiring users interested in this feature to consider the Hero 11. Both cameras support earbud pairing for wireless microphone functionality although, the audio quality is less than stellar. Voice commands offer convenient control for both devices particularly useful in water-based activities, where touchscreen are impractical. The Ace Pro goes a step further with gesture control, allowing users to initiate video recording with erased palm or capture a photo with a P sign. An exclusive Insta360 feature is the ability to cancel recording providing a handy solution when capturing attempts at tricks or actions. This feature prevents SD card clutter and streamlines the process of finding footage amidst multiple takes and uncomplicated yet practical addition. The Intro 360 Ace Pro is fitted with a 1650mA battery while the GoPro Hero 12 boasts a slightly larger 1720mA Enduro battery. Consequently, the Hero 12 enjoys a slight edge in battery capacity, transitioning to some extra operating time compared to the Ace Pro. The Hero 12 Black hit the market in September 2023 and has been on retail shelves ever since priced at $399.99. Notably, there's no mandatory GoPro subscription to access this pricing, a departure from some earlier models. In comparison, the Insta360 Ace Pro was unveiled on November 21, 2023 and became available for purchase on the same day. Priced slightly higher at $449.99, it enters the market as an alternative option for those seeking its unique features and capabilities. In short, both these action cameras stand out in their own ways making either a solid choice. They are rugged and waterproof designs coupled with exceptional video quality, given their compact size make them reliable options. If your shooting tendencies lean toward night or indoor settings, the Insta360 Ace Pro takes the lead excelling in low-light video capture compared to the Hero 12 Black. The Ace Pro enhances convenience with its quick-release mounting system, user-friendly, flip-up screen, and a more seamless app connection. Now on the flip side, the GoPro remains the champion in well-lit scenario, delivering superior image quality. It outtrades audio performance and offers a more extensive set of features catering to professional videographers, all at a slightly lower cost. For many the GoPro remains a preferable choice tracking a balance between affordability and top-notch performance. That's all for today. Thanks for watching a video. Like and share with your friends if you find this video to be helpful. Then don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you want more videos like this on your feed.